Texas Police Union is calling Mayor Satya Rhodes Conway's comments problematic. And those comments are from a blog posted Tuesday where she calls an officer's actions in responding to a mental health call unacceptable. Gabriela Becerra shares the union's concerns and how the mayor's office is addressing them. Gabby? Mayor Satya Rhodes Conway posted a blog Tuesday in which she addressed a Madison police officer's handling of a mental health call for a 17-year-old African-American in June. The incident is currently under investigation. Madison Professional Police Officers Association says multiple members have voiced concerns about what her comments could mean for the investigation and the expectations of officers. Madison's police union president Kelly Powers says the comments Mayor Satya Rhodes Conway wrote in the blog could be dangerous for officers. What it does is it puts doubt in the minds of officers who have to make these decisions in the field. In a letter response to Rhodes Conway, Powers wrote, your statements not only risk influencing the outcome of that external review, they also threaten to influence the public's perception surrounding this incident. The issue at hand is the commentary and how it impacts officers and their safety. You know, the subject matter of getting out in front of an investigation before it's closed, um, that's, that's problematic. In her blog post, Rhodes Conway wrote, the officer's actions may or may not have violated the law and may or may not have violated MPD policy. However, police actions in this incident are not and will never be acceptable as best practice. Deputy Mayor Cameron McClay says the blog was not intended to call out this individual officer. I just ask you revisit it from the context of what we just talked about and you'll notice the phrase best practice. We're talking at the 30,000 foot level, not about this individual officer. McLay says he doesn't believe the investigation will be affected by the mayor's comments. This kind of macro level insistence on setting up leadership standards that keep us focused on doing better each and every time shouldn't and I can't envision how it would sway the investigators in a particular case. Rather, setting expectations for situations down the road. What we want is shared understanding, shared diagnosis of our problems, and then come together and say, what's the best way to fix this? And that's something both Powers and the mayor's office say they will collaborate on. Power says there will be meetings to better discuss what the mayor's vision is, and McClay says their office looks forward to working together to create best practices. Gabby, thank you. New